Now, I do want to check out a new trailer that came out this week. I've heard of it. It's Angelina Jolie's new film. I haven't had a chance to watch it yet. I'm going to watch it here with you guys and react to it. It's called Those Who Wish Me Dead. I believe it's based on a book or something. I'm not really sure. Heard of it before, and this trailer just dropped the other day. So thought I'd uh, give it a watch here with you guys and see what we thought. So here we go with the trailer of Those Who Wish Me Dead. Why'd they put you in a fire tower? Well, I'm just lucky, I guess. Is this like... That game Firewatch? I read the wind wrong. I should have gone to them. Oh, are they like those fire jumpers? They like jump in and the... you've been dead too. Are those real people that do that? And they made that movie about it a long time ago, like in the 90s. That's our job. Oh, she's talking to somebody on the phone. Is this... Is this like Firewatch the movie? Hey! Stop! I'm not gonna hurt you. No, I don't remember I a kid being in that game. From. It's not my I never beat it, though. Oh, Sicario. In trouble? Sicario was pretty good. Uh-oh. Oh, this Anyone is not Firewatch. Ooh, shit! Damn! My dad said Damn, pull through that one. If anything happened, I should find someone I can trust. Oh. Are you someone I can trust? So, okay, the dad had something these guys were looking for. Hey, was that Tyler Perry? James Barnthal? I always want to call him Shane. Those men that came for your father. Did you see their faces? That's them? Yeah, so the dad had something they want. He gave it to the kid, and now she's trying to get the kid out alive. I wonder what it is. Give him something else to worry about. Hey, it's, uh, oh, what is his name? He's always a bad guy. He was the bad guy in Quantum Break. Plays a good bad guy. Listen. Wasn't she like a firefighter or something? You're gonna run. run for a long and you're gonna keep running. Fire looks pretty that good. That is everything in its path. You really wanna die for this kid? Uh oh. So is she gonna be like a. Oh, she got like a Laura Croft pick thing. Hold it. Is she going back to her Laura Croft, Laura Croft roots? Yeah, I think she is. Look. Well, she's gonna punch a shark. <laughs> what happens next? You're looking right in the eye. Yeah. Those who wish me dead. That's a pretty cool title. All right. Yeah, that was, I mean, it didn't, I mean, I guess it, that's a good thing. It didn't give me a lot, which that's what I want out of a trailer. I want a trailer to give me an idea of what the movie, you know, give me a basic synopsis of what it's going to be about. Don't tell me too much. Don't give it all away. And that's what it did. I think it was pretty good. Um, It's been a while since I've seen Angelina Jolie in anything, especially action oriented. Uh, I'm trying to remember the last thing I saw her in. It's been a while. She's been kind of off the grid a bit. Um, I know she had some medical issues a while back. I'm assuming she got that taken care of. I was kind of getting Firewatch vibes for a little bit, if you're familiar with that game. Uh, more of a walking simulator, though, and that was, you know, that was at first, but after the trailer started going, that is not Firewatch. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm interested in seeing that. I mean... Uh, is it on the top of my list just based on that trailer? No, but it's going to be on HBO Max. It said day and date. So, yeah, why not? If it, I mean, if it's, it's there, I can watch it at home. That is that is definitely a movie that I would watch at home. If that was coming only to theaters, I'd probably be like, hmm, depends on what else I got going on. We'll see. But since it will be on HBO Max day and date, yeah, I'll definitely watch that. And see, right there, that shows the, the value to this whole you know, releasing on streaming and in theaters at the same time because I wouldn't probably, there's a really good chance I wouldn't go to the theaters to see that if it was only there. 
And uh, now I will be watching it and giving my two cents on it. But yeah, it was, it was good to see Angelina Jolie back in an action or, or at least a more physical role. I do wonder how is is this movie because there were a couple of moments I saw. I was like, okay, she she's doing some not superhuman stuff, but some you know, a little bit you know more than your average person kind of stuff. So is this going to be a little bit of an over the top action film? Is she going to become like some stone cold badass like pretty much Laura Croft is this like her re re uh, reliving her Laura Croft days uh, she had like the 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 climbing pick or whatever they call it and she's going underwater and jumping off the the side of the fire tower hanging onto the rope and all that and I don't know I mean that doesn't mean it'll be bad I mean it could still be dumb fun but I'm wondering if they're going for a realistic take if she's going to do all that you know, what direction is this movie going? I guess we'll find out. Um, I do wonder what it is that kid had. What's so important that these people are sending, like, death squads after this kid? It looked like they were, uh, like, had badges and stuff, too. So they're sending official death squads after this guy and his kid, and they're going through all this, burning a forest down and everything for whatever it was his dad handed this kid. I mean, is it really that important? At what point does this kid just say, here, just fucking take it? <laughs> whatever it is. I don't know, we'll find out. Uh, it is based on a book. I have heard that people really like the book. I know nothing about the book, so I couldn't tell you. It is a book I have not read, I'm not familiar with. But just based on what I saw there, it didn't give us a lot. But I like when trailers do that. I don't like when they tell you the whole story. I like when they leave you baited and say, hey, I want to know a little bit more. And I, I'm, after that trailer, yeah, I want to know a little bit more. I mean, I'm not super hyped about it, but... Like I said, it's coming to streaming day and date, so I will watch it as soon as it comes out. And when I do watch it, I will absolutely let you guys know what I think in a review. Uh, whenever it said it's coming out, I, I, it said there at the end. I'm not sure. I'm not going to go back and look either, but <laughs> it's coming soon. It's coming this year. Uh, but Those Who Wish Me Dead, starring Angelina Jolie. What would you think? I thought it was, it was all right. It was cool. Yeah, cool. Could be a good time. We'll find out. Um sometime whenever it does come out but looking forward to it thanks for checking out this clip from the jarcast movie podcast if you like this and want more then check out the jacob anders review youtube channel where you can also find movie reviews every monday wednesday friday and sunday you can also listen to the entire podcast on all major podcasting platforms such as spotify google and itunes so if you prefer audio whichever one is your preferred check it out there once again i really appreciate it and thanks for watching and as always stay sexy youtube